Look at these little birds, man. That's crazy. This shit is so fucking beautiful, man. I swear to God, this shit is so fucking nice. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Glowway Sam. Come back at y'all with another video, man. And honestly, I'm not on my camera right now. I'm not on my camera right now because I didn't even expect to make this video. It was just kind of, you know, on some random shit. Right now, it's 8 in the morning. I just decided to walk down here to the beach. And I just want to talk to y'all today really about just going out and chasing y'all dreams, man. I call this Monday Motivation. Going out and chasing dreams, man. Honestly, my perspective, I've been an underdog in everything in my fucking life. Everything. Any little thing I do, I'm always the underdog. I'm always doubted 100%. Everything when it comes from YouTube, to girls, to basketball, to school, and, and all these advanced classes and shit, man. I'm always underdog every fucking time, man. And you know how irritating that shit make me? That shit makes me fucking sick, dude. Because I always gotta come from the bottom and try to rise up every time. And it's like, sometimes I be feeling like, what if I can't rise to the occasion type shit, you feel me? But it's like, the point is, no matter what, you gotta keep going. No matter what obstacle coming your way, you gotta keep going. You gotta keep fighting through it. And that's kind of like the type of shit that I live by. You gotta keep going no matter what. Keep going, keep going, keep going. No matter what happened, keep going. Fuck it, keep going no matter what happened. Because nothing in life, for me, in my mind, nothing in life go the way I expect it to go. You feel me? Nothing in my life has ever gone the way that I'd expect it to be. I wouldn't expect to be right here on this beach right now at 8 in the morning. Honestly, I wouldn't even expect to be in this whole area right now if my life went the way I wanted it to. <sighs> this is crazy right now, man. Honestly, uh, you're going to have people getting in your ear, convincing you to do certain little things that aren't good for you. Don't listen to them. It's going to be shit. Let's say you're in college. I'm in college right now. I now understand what people mean when they say it's hard to balance partying or you have to balance partying in school because I'm bouncing partying, school, and YouTube. And I noticed with me, I use parties as an excuse. I use YouTube as an excuse to go to parties. I'd be like, oh, I gotta record this party, bro. I gotta go to every party. Nah, bro, I don't. And even if I do, I don't gotta get hella involved in it. You feel me? It's like my mind is playing tricks on me. I get unfocused and I get focused again. I get unfocused and focused again, unfocused and focused again. It's like, I won't even touch my schoolwork for like three, four days. And I know where I just sit down and do eight hours worth of schoolwork, eight hours of homework. You feel me? It's cause in my mind, I know, even if I'm not on it every day, I know in my mind, I gotta keep working. I gotta keep grinding cause I'm not where I wanna be right now, man. Where I wanna be, what do my goals look like? Man, just being successful in general and whatever the fuck I do. Even if I don't become a famous YouTuber, you feel me? I just want to be successful. I want to do something that means something. I want to make something that's going to change the world, man. And I don't think when I say that, like, I don't think y'all going to feel me. Like, y'all might laugh behind the screen when you watch that, when I say that shit, because y'all don't really know me like that yet. But I'm telling you, like, that's how I am. Like, dead ass. I'm dead ass serious. No jokes. No jokes. No gimmick. Nothing. I want to do something that's going to change the world. I want to do something that's going to change the world for one person. You feel me? And by that, I mean, I wanna change somebody's life or people's lives. I wanna be able to have an influence on people, a positive influence. I wanna be able to tell you to stop bullshitting and chase your fucking dream and you listen to me. Cause that's the most important thing, chasing your dreams. It don't matter what it is, dude. It don't matter what it is. If you wanna be a fucking garbage man, go be a fucking garbage man. Go watch all the fucking YouTube videos and read books on how to be the best fucking garbage man and get paid the most as that fucking garbage man. Right now, at this point in my life, my goal right now is YouTube. I wanna become a successful YouTuber. So what I'm gonna do is keep grinding towards it every day, never stopping. If you know me, if you, if, you, if you live anywhere near me right now, then you know, what do they call me? They call me the cameraman. Walk around my camera 24 seven. I'm never not without my camera, always with my camera. You know why? I'm always perfecting my crap. I'm always trying to find a different way to shoot some shit or a different way to, uh, to edit some shit. Man, I'm always working, striving for greatness, trying to get better, you know? I'm not gonna lie, and and I, I can see the, the improvement in myself too because when I first started vlogging and shit, I, I used to hate vlogging because people would be like looking at me and I hate that. I hate when people look at me, bro. I hate attention, I'm, I'm an introvert. So I hate people look at me, but that just goes to show you, taste your dreams no matter what. I'm an introvert, I hate attention, yet, I'm walking around with a camera, recording myself, 
And every time I pull the camera out, it brings attention. So, you feel me? It just, it's just, that also, like, just like I said before, any obstacle, any obstacle that you gotta face in life, face it. Fuck it. Fight through the adversity. Keep going. Don't stop. No matter what. Like, I'm serious, bro. I'm serious. I'm really talking to you. I'm serious. Like, I want all of y'all on here right now that's watching this to really be successful, to do something worthwhile in your life. Don't just, wherever you're at right now, stop and be complacent and stay in that place for the rest of your life and get old and die. Do something that's going to mean something, dude. You get one fucking life. You get one life. You don't get two. You don't get three. You get one fucking life. And life is short. Life can be taken from you like this. Trust me, I know. Life can be taken from you like this right here. Last thing you want is for your life to be taken and you ain't did nothing worthwhile. Even if you ain't gone to no good parties or no, no, it did nothing fun or enjoying yourself, do something. Shit, even the most focused people ever gotta have some type of fun. They do something that's fun to them. You feel me? Don't be, don't be so focused to the point where you're not enjoying yourself and you just letting a bunch of stress build up and shit like that. Cause I was at that point too. I just went through probably every emotion you can go through when it comes to wanting to do some shit and want to be successful at some shit. I swear to God, I'm not even successful yet, but I haven't been through every emotion of it already. I done been through the stressful parts. I done been through the parts where it's like, damn, I, I can't do nothing. I can't do nothing fun. I, I gotta focus. I gotta do this, this, and this, this. I gotta focus. I can't go out. I can't do this. I can't do that. I done been through that shit, dude. And that shit is not good for you either. Waking up and your chest hurt and you stress the fuck out. And you feel me? You just, you want it so bad, but you can't have it yet. It's something that you want so bad, but you can't have it yet. That shit hurts you. That shit hurt me. And I'm not gonna lie, honestly, right now, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just talking. I'm just spilling out my thoughts. So when I post this shit, when I edit this shit, I'm not even gonna edit it at all, cause I'm not gonna look at it. I don't wanna watch this shit back, cause I don't wanna hear what the fuck I'm saying. But all I'm gonna do is put some like little music over and some shit. And just post that shit up for y'all. However many views it gets, however many views it gets, I don't give a fuck. But it's just a little message to y'all, man. It's a little message to y'all and a message to myself. I'm also talking to myself. Chase your fucking dreams. Whatever you want to do, go do that shit. The shit sounds cliche. I swear to God, it sounds cliche. But you see where I'm at right now. I'm on the beach right now. I don't know why, but I thought this would be the perfect environment for me to make this type of video. I'm going to tell you to go chase your fucking dream, man. Because I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's big houses over there. Big houses over there. I don't know if y'all can see it though. And one thing about me, in a couple years, I wanna get a big ass house. In a couple years, I want a house that's worth some millions. In a couple years, I want some cars that's worth some millions. In a couple years, I want some millions. You feel me? And it's not even on no monetary shit or no, oh, I'm, I'm, uh, what is it called? I'm like worshiping materialistic things. It's not even on that type of shit. It's just on, that's the level of success that I want for myself. A lot of people say money don't make them happy. If I had money, a lot of my problems would be gone. That's all I'm saying. If I had money, a lot of problems would be gone, and that's the success level. For me, it's all about reaching that success level. I can always get peace and happiness within myself. For what I'm trying to do, for what I'm trying to be successful at, I do need money for that. And I understand that. It's always a, it's, 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 it's a, fuck, I don't, honestly. I'm sorry, I'm fucking rambling right now, but back to the point. Taste your fucking dreams. Don't let nobody get in your fucking way, dude. If they get in your way, cut them off. If you got friends that's, that's fucking you over and they don't really got your best interest at heart, cut them niggas off. Cut them bitches off too. They don't fucking matter, man. It really don't. We all here for one reason. That's to s fulfill your purpose. What is your purpose? It's like Nipsey Hussle said, find your purpose or you wasting air. I haven't found my purpose yet. So I'm wasting the air right now, but I'll find it soon. And even if I, I'm doing my purpose right now and I don't know, then I'm, I'm gonna figure it out soon. Gotta fix the bottom of my fucking sockets coming off, man. Uh, shit is a little ashy. My shit is a little ashy, I know. I put some lotion on last night though and I fell asleep. I know it's a little ashy, fuck it, I gotta fix though. But remember, do what makes you happy. If you don't got no dreams, make one. Do what makes you happy. Grind that shit out. Grind it all the way out. You're gonna feel so much better once you grind that shit out. Being an underdog gonna feel good. But guess what? Everybody got a sad story. Nobody gives a fuck about the sad story. They only give a fuck about the success story. So do you wanna be just another sad story or do you wanna be a success story? Rise to the occasion. Let's go.
chase your fucking dreams, dude. Chase your fucking dreams.